Welcome boys, kind teachers. And today, to start everything off, we have a B4 RS4. Quite dirty, but very, very nice looking B4. If you want to see what this looks like in like pictures, I'll pop them up right, right now. You'll just see how nice this thing looks. And we have this really, really super crazy Crescida right here, two JZ swap. I assume. I'm gonna show you the engine right now, so you'll catch me at the front of the Crescida. And ah, yes, check this out. Now let's talk Crescida after all. I'm gonna pop up the sound clip right now, and you'll hear what this, sounds, this thing sounds like. Just see, single turbo two JZ. Wow, this thing looks, this thing looks mint, mint and sounds super crazy. Pop up the clip right now. Yes, this is Crescida, bro. And we have random supercars that just pulled up, of course. A 2RS, a 3RS, three, a three and an F8. And a Roush Mustang. These look proper. These look proper. We've got a bunch more this side. A, a bit of everything, honestly. We've got S3s, RS3s. And these are tuned, okay? Not really your, your normal stock RS3s and S3s. I'm gonna show you the block, as you can see right here. They're not really stock. With the. And this one right over here. The Unitronic, in, Unitronic intake. Looks super nice, if I may say so myself. And of course, we have an R34 in white, which looks really, really nice. And we're having a rev battle on that side, it sounds like. I might head over that side and show you the rev battle. Sounds super nice and sounds like an SVR, of course. And we have a R35 GTR next to an R34 GTR, which looks super stunning together. Mustang is an ear piercer, yes.
Alright, so that's the Porsche. That's uh, and yeah, casually the Mustang smoking. Yes. This is crazy. Yes. Check it And yeah, we're back from all that action. We have a BMW M3 here. Check how clean this thing is with the black exterior and a cream interior. Oh, this thing looks super nice. And for the age of this car, he's kept it super duper clean. This guy. And that's not it. We have red rods, hot rods, all over the place. I'm gonna show you this other custom one in a moment. This one, the exterior is made to look old. Wow, I like it. It's got very crazy exterior. So now I'm gonna walk you to one of the craziest I've seen here. So yeah, check this out. Check the petrol gauge, just see. So industrial thing. You got the low bed and check the double stack exhaust. Rust like a trucker. Freaking it. This looks super nice. And the rusty exterior, I like it. Adds the finishing touch. Oh, sounds nice. And yes, casually we're back to the GTRs coming full circle. As I was talking about this GTR, I forgot to show you these <laughs> carbon fiber <laughs> exhaust pipes right there. Match, color match, white on white, Godzilla. Let's see, R35 and R35. You had to pick. And now we've come to the stand section. As you can see, we have a 2 liter turbo S3 right here, which is bloody nice. On the ground, very nice cars right here. Wow, the stand section, two, R two S, one S4 and an RS4. Wow, and check this nice golf right here with a VW Super Pro front bumper. Yes, this looks proper. Six proper. And of course, this is not limited to the channel. The Nissan GTR. Have you seen it twice or three times? And we've got more build cars. Check the intake side, the intake pipe side. But fully built out, fully built out Civic right here, which looks super sick. What is that? And we have the W204. Just made some noise. Come here specifically for this. Check how nice this looks with the gold Boston wheels and this silver, silver, gray exterior. And of course, they play some games. And here we have a nice little GTI, a Land Cruiser, of course. And yeah, I've kind of walked around, so now I'll show you some more. This is proper nice looking with the gold wheels. And it sounds sick as well. Right here we have a race car mini, of course. Check how stripped out the interior is. Absolutely nothing. Check the climate control pipe right there. The steering wheel is whatever that is. Man, yes, this, this thing is absolutely crazy. The back, check the wheels. It's more of like a drift car, to be honest with you. Probably it is a race, it is a race car. It's probably quick as shit. And we have this nice Expel, Expel PPF Supra right here, which has matte PPF, yes. And we have another race car. Race cars are all over the place today. With the VTEC. Oh, check how nice this thing looks. It's probably pushing like a freak ton of power. Stripped out at the back, absolutely nothing. Wow. Always well, on the track, it's been dinged up a few times. Track cars, of course. And if I walk you through this side to the more JDM section, we have a Type R right here with an intake. So if you see here, it's full built out Type R and a full built out S200, S2000 I mean. Check the intake, everything looks super nice. This, this is something else. Proper, proper built out, nothing short on it. Built out to the max. Four tail pipes and the S2000 of course. Walk you over to another section right 
and we've walked into the Ace Customs Laboratory. And we have this Ace Customs Let the Lotus build. Just see. Check this thing out. Oh yeah, this is a brand seven. Thought it would be. It's more of like a brand seven with like an SP1 Monza conversion. This has got one seat and a cover. Absolutely love this thing. Imagine how much ripping you'd have in this. How much fun this thing is. Only one light right there. Not safe at all, eh? So I'll show you more cars the Ace Customs have. And as you can see, you can see like the build process and stuff. I'll show you more cars. They have this 350 right here with like a babe wrap, which looks all right, I guess. Right, fully stripped out with nothing and a huge spoiler, of course. And the interior is fully stripped out with carbon fiber replacing the screen. Fully built out, nothing sort of built out. And we have this American muscle. Fully built out as well. Everything these guys have is fully built out and still clean. Check the steering collar. Absolutely nice. I think this is a drag car. It's got like, yeah, it's a drag car and it's got like tons of power if you actually think of it. A tons of power. And we have this E30 right here. I like to tell you more about this E30 because, but I also don't know shit about it. So it's got like a sound system here at the back and a very clean custom interior which kind of looks OEM so you can say an OEM plus in the interior which I absolutely love I don't have a problem with it especially that this car is this clean I absolutely love it the interior has been taken care of the exhaust has been taken care of but I want to show you something else that's been taken care of this E30 right just supercharged V8 E30 Lexus V8 E30 just look at how let's get the perfection of this Absolute perfected V8 4 cam. Absolute perfection, like intakes and a med injection. Everything is built up, like rear exit exhaust and everything. Absolutely everything is nice about this thing. Nothing I could say I don't like about this. And smoked out tailpipes and a white body kit. And it's painted. Painted, not right, like painted. Also have a chopped off BMW Z3 met injection more of like a race car more than anything else got those race harnesses so you don't bash your head race seat sequential gearbox super nice no it's a four speed manual super nice Nishimoto for the win check out how clean this exhaust build is and the exhaust of course this build is super duper clean and the splitter this can chop the exhaust wow it looks absolutely nice no headlights, just intakes. Well, this is absolutely great. So yeah, let's move on to the next thing and I'll show you around the next thing. So we've moved to this section. We have a Nissan GTR and a 911 Turbo. Look at the size of those brakes. Those are massive. Those are as fast as this car goes, it needs to stop us. Yes. Yeah. And check the dark lights on this. It's got Boston and dark lights. What's your take on the dark lights? I think they look super sick. I think they look super sick. The CS type of lights. I think they look super sick. It's got an aftermarket exa exhaust as well. This is proper. And the Boss as well. So you can dig this. Super nice. Black on black. You 
fade away As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby, have a taste All the highs and the lows no, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never felt this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way Trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away